Hello and welcome back to Rude Kaiser's playthrough of Magic the Gathering Chandelar. Today we're going to do something we should have done a long time ago. And that is clear out the Green Wizard's Castle. Who dares to challenge the Mighty Green Wizard? Are you brave enough to enter my castle? Yes. Yes, I am. Everyone will start, well, everyone but me, I guess, will start with the Birds of Paradise in play. That's cool. I wish I had a Birds of Paradise in play. Got a Beastmaster over there. So we're going to get a little lay of the land real quick to see what we can, a uh, monkey. See what we can find. Another monkey. Uh, lots of monkeys are in here. That would appear to be nothing. That too would appear to be nothing. I guess, we know because that just leads right here. This just leads right here. We have to get through, let's cross this monkey's path. Clearly, you're the one in the way, Ape Lord. We're gonna open by cracking our misty rainforest for a bayou. We're then gonna crack the windswept heath for a scrubland, which will allow us to cast our beloved chaplain. Friend to all animals. Oh, but not, not a friend to lightning bolts. He gets bolted and dies. Then he plays a 2 2 curd ape and another 2 2 curd ape. A 2 3 curd ape, my mistake. Vindicate your mountain. Actually, if I vindicate the, the forest, your monsters will actually get weaker, so I'm going to do that. Get another forest crap. Don't know what I was expecting. A maze of Ith and an Elvish Mystic. Hopefully, my Lanoir Elf can. Okay, never mind. My Lanoir Elf cannot help. I'll remove that one from combat and just take a th whopping three. Even if I maze this one, I'm gonna lose two and take it. Oh, you were unceremoniously booted from the stronghold of the Mighty Green Wizard. Bump. Oh, that's whack. Alright, we're gonna try this again. Hopefully there'll be less apes this time. Honestly, that's what did me in. The fact that there were apes everywhere. If there was something other than apes like Altkesh Genies. I didn't want to walk into you. Or Tuskmasters. Oh no, my chaplain is on the line. Crack my rainforest for a savannah and pass. He played a lion of the savannah. I will, out of fear of Empiric Link, your savannah lion, so I don't take any damage from it. Because I'm a huge coward, and you're a gigantic growth, the one that's already pumped. That's cool. Out of curiosity, what if I just happen to vindicate that one? What's your plan now? Yeah, I didn't think so. Play for Duven Enchantress and pass. So if they all have Spirit Link, I actually don't know what's gonna happen if the Spirit Linked Banded thing attacks me. Will it? Do they all deal damage for me? I'm gonna just take it. Oh, that's probably oh, he berserked the bird. What? No, I just took two. So I took two and gained two. So only the War Elephant could hurt me. Intriguing. I drew into the Wombat. Now what I need is an aura. Besides that one that I wasted on the stupid lion. Oh, you, you can't win all the battles. What if I just throw my 2-4 in front of your dude? And then what? It died? That's whack. How about an angel of despair, your only threat? Your bird being a 3-4 does not change anything. But just in case you get a big idea that it does... I'm gonna grab the Soul Link. And swing at you for five in the air. I'm gonna give our Rune Scar Demon the Soul Link and greedily cast the Sylvan Library. Now we swing for six. Beautiful, you love to see it. Block there, he giant growths my thing for some reason. Maybe he just misclicked. What did I even draw? That would help to pay the life. Whatever it is, it's probably worth it. No, it mad wasn't worth it, just a bunch of lands. Crack my heath for a bayou. And then swing for lethal. Get your silly ass out of my way. I will start with a beloved chaplain. How wonderful. So I'm looking for something that resembles a wizard. None of y'all are wizards. I guess I have to fight you now. Fine. Let's go. The alt al genie starts with the Lanoir Elves. That's nothing I can't handle. Given that I start with a beloved chaplain in play. I already forgot about that. Elvish Mystic, swing with the chaplain. There's nair you could do about that. I have two of those in my deck? I didn't even know that. Swing with the chaplain again. 
He gains himself two life to undo the two damage I've done to him. That's almost more insulting than anything. Swing for two! I'll take that two life back, if you don't mind. Probably shouldn't have played the maze. Swing for two! Eventually, this is gonna kill you unless you do something about it. You know, if you want. You can only really survive f four more turns of this. Swing with Lanawar Elf? Why? Okay. Attack me for one. I wasn't expecting it, but... I also <laughs> wasn't that scared about it. Swing for two. Cast the Rune Scar Demon to tutor for my Verduvin... Ver... Verduran... Verduran Enchantress. Swing for one again? What if I just... Throw a demon in front of you. What, what, are, you, what are you gonna do then? Oh, you had no play for that? Okay, you're just squirming because you're dying. That's really sad, my guy. Oh, there's no reason to dick around. I could just kill you. I'm gonna come back and kill you. Putting the enchantments on my demon like I need to bother. Oh, and no, I can't kill you yet. You have a blocker. See? I was kind of paying attention. I mean, if I was paying attention, I would have just bolted the blocker. But then I wouldn't be able to deal with the cockatrice. But he would, he would be dead, so, you know. You win some, you lose some. Die, cockatrice! You don't belong in this world. Is that lethal? It's lethal. Well, there's some goodies. I'm not here for goodies, though. I'm here to kill the guy. How? What is the power rating of Primeval Shambler? Wrong. Primeval Shambler is a 3-3. Three, three. I didn't want to go that way. Anyway, I will start with the Enchantress in my next duel. That's handy. It appears that this is the way I should have gone. So I'm going to head back to the beginning while avoiding all enemies. Well, while avoiding as many enemies as I can. These spells cost one white and one colorless. Captain of the Watch does not cost two. Steadfast Guard might, ca might cost two. Sinodos Sliver. Let's go with Steadfast Guard. It was the Sinodos Sliver, which means I gotta fight a genie now! Whatever, fine, get out of my way. Just enough to kill him. I wonder what's your garden, homie. Fairly curious, but I'll worry about that in a second. So, the master has to either be right past here or right past here. I feel like I have a better chance of defeating this than I do a forest dragon. So let's beat the Tusk Guardian. Die, monster. Goodies! This was the wrong way. Looks like I have to fight the forest dragon. At least one of them. Huh, there's a forest walker in play. That's problematic. I, I played a maze turn one so I could keep this thing locked down and I pro proceeded to not use it at all. What an idiot. What an absolute buffoon. Now I will maze your stupid dryad. I could kill one of your forests instead. You're already pretty ahead, though. What? Oh, I wasn't paying. I wasn't paying attention. What a stupid. Ah! Oh! oh, I'm such an idiot. I literally had one that stopped that, and I chose to waste another useful card for no reason. Oh, that hurts. Oh, the pain. Bruh. I'm pretty sure I can, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's die from this. All that effort, just to get stomped out. Alright, we're gonna try this one more time with our face-beating deck. If this goes worse than the last one, because the last one was pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, the last attempt was a really solid one. I didn't, we didn't find the wizard, but we at least got through a lot of his goons. I can kill all the goons I want outside, the point is to defeat the wizard himself. Hooray, I start with a cudgel troll. He does not look like the guy I'm looking for. And I don't want to pick fights for no reason. He does look like the wizard, though. Maybe that is him. A great druid? So him being a great druid means he's not the wizard I'm looking for, right? That, that's what that means. 
that this is not who I'm here to find. I'll blast your thing for one. You didn't swing back? Well, I have nothing really to do, so I'm going to also blow up your thing for one. Yeah, I have no land to play. Isn't that wild? That that was kind of horseshit. That that one didn't feel that one didn't feel as good as the other ones. That like, that was a that was a mean loss. You know what? I've been at this for almost an hour now. We're gonna call it right here. I'll have you guys know that as it stands, be a little be a little transparent. This magic LP is rough. I am no longer. Well, I don't want to say I'm not having fun playing it, but it's way more of a chore than it used to be. But the only reason I'm keeping it up is because I know for sure it is the only series I have that brings in numbers. So I'll ask you all this, my true fans who actually got to the end of this video, what is it that you wish to see? Do you want me to keep playing this? Because I am not, <laughs> like I'm not doing good anymore. I'm, I have eight life against opponents who start off like a minimum of 12. And like the life lead isn't too big of a deal, but when they have, like when you're up against someone with 20 something life and your minimum cap, like your maximum cap isn't even past 10. It's, it's daunting. It's daunting. I'm gonna tell you that right up front. It's daunting. I don't really, like, I don't really want to brute force my way through it. Maybe, maybe? Would you guys be cool with, like, restarting the series? Is there another card game you guys would like to watch? Because I know I made, I made a lot of fans who were just Magic fans, and I'm a real huge fan of Magic. I love playing Magic. That's why I got this far in this series. But given that the other Pokemon one just ended, there's a lot going on right now. On, like, behind the scenes at Kaiser Inc. I should, we should call it Kaiser Inc. That's a cool name. But uh, I'll leave it up to you. Tell me what you think. Give me what you, give me your opinions. Make sure you leave comments and tell your friends to subscribe. This might be the first time I've mentioned this, but you guys are doing great. Like you guys have really been enjoying this magic series. And I'm super happy to see it. And I really want to keep giving you guys great content. So, you know, let me know what you think, what you're feeling. But that's basically it. This game's getting real hard. And I can brute force it for you guys, but progress will be hitting a screeching halt if that is the case. Because we kind of, we're kind of at a dead end here. Well, all that aside, I've been your iridescent host, Rude Kaiser, reminding each of you that I would die a thousand deaths before I let you harm another. Enjoy the rest of your day. And did you know that only 15% of my viewership is actually subscribed? Given how many people are enjoying this series, you think it'd be a lot more than that, but unfortunately not. So I'm going to ask you guys formally, you should really hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. Not all at the same time, I think they're three different buttons. But you should hit each and every last one of them. Because I love you.